If you pair this with Delina, if you pair this with Delina exclusive, you hurt in the room, okay? You coming in, you know what you're doing. The room is looking at you and you know what you're doing. You meant to do that, clearly. <laughs> but this Ladies, ladies, and gentlemen, this is Amber coming to you with the Fray View, coming to you with another video review. And today we are going to get into my top 10 Zara fragrances for the summer. So if you're interested in seeing what my top picks are for this year, <laughs> just keep watching. Hello, family. Welcome back. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back, family. Hey, and if you're new to this channel, my name is Amber, and on this channel, we review fragrances and body care, and we spill sip a little tea from here and there. Yo, sis, may go laugh. Mm -hmm. That's okay. Just subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. We'd love to get to know you and meet you. And hey, family, hey, I hope you all are doing well. Hey, new family, I hope you all are doing really well. Thank you so much for joining and coming back to this channel. Well, we are going to get right into it. I have some... Zara fragrances for you and I have my top 10 picks for the summer and now you know oh okay now when people do lists we we already know okay well well may, maybe you know welcome okay but for me <laughs> honey this list might be different next year but that's okay because sometimes it might change things change did you all know that Things change from year to year, month to month, day to day. There are things that change. So we'll say this year, this is my top picks from Zara. And I have 10, so let's get right into it because you know you know what I'm doing. Your sis can talk. So we have, okay, none other than the Zara Red Temptation. And this is Summer. Of course, she had to be at the top, and this isn't ranked in no type of order, but I had to start off with her because, honey, this was made for the summer. And if you all have the other line, like if you have uh, Red Temptation, the original, I'll just call it original. If you have Zara, Red Temptation, if you have the winter, then, honey, I'm sure you have the summer. Or if you don't have the summer, that, that's why my eyes are a little... I don't understand if you got all the other ones why do you don't have summer so summer is such a good one and I have described her before as kind of like the or the toilette version of the red temptation line this is such a beauty a must have for the summer if you are a Zara lover a fan a Zara fragrance girl now if you not it's okay not everybody got like Zara Okay, you know y'all wear the clothes, but not everybody got to like Zara. Man, maybe some of y'all don't wear the clothes, but it's okay. Zara is a good one, and this one right here, mm, let's get into the notes, okay? So top notes, we have lychee raspberry, we have some rose petals, we have some peony, amber, praline, and musk. This is such a pretty one that I am going to be rocking this summer. I am so excited to have this. This is definitely date night. Day day. Well, I wouldn't say date night. Definitely day day. Brunch out with the girls. Casual meetup, right? If you're a part of a girls club or whatever, okay? This is definitely the best friend you want to have for those events, okay? Moving on. Next up, we're going to talk about, okay, Miss Jo. Okay, Miss Jo Malone, okay? Like I know her. I call her Miss Jo. Um, but... Honey, Miss Jo be stepping in there for Zara and be like, here she is, and boom, and party, and hit the party up. Mm, you're welcome. Like, she comes in, throws down, gives you some concoction, and you like, well, well, well did you have to do us like that, right? Did, did you have to do us like that? Y'all can't do me like this. Oh, 
Okay, we understand. So, she did not misstep, in my opinion, when she created Unexpected Joy. When I tell you, honey, it was unexpected, and it definitely gave me joy. I know you like that was so wet. It, it's okay, you know. Sometimes I give a little corniness. It's fine. Um, but when I tell you, this is oh, you all. This is so pretty. Okay, oh, this is like seriously like everything pink. She got everything pink. Pink hair. Pink clothes, pink room, pink bed. Like, oh, it's just such a feminine fragrance. Oh, my goodness. I love this. Oh, and it gives you joy and it just sparks. Okay, let's get into the notes. So we have bergamot. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, we have neroli, cedar, and magnolia. Like, this is such a pretty floral fragrance. And to me... Honey, if you do not like a floral fragrance, I would still try this. This is amazing, in my opinion. Like, again, Miss Joe <laughs> brought it out for you and said, what you got to say? I, I done helped you out. And the packaging looks like her packaging for her fragrance with the circle bulb on the top. This is a must okay so if you see this on zara highly recommend you get this in your collection okay sis moving on next up in that same line from miss joe we got energy vibes okay and who don't need an energy vibe okay honey don't nobody like no stuffy person okay i i let you know that now if you wondering is somebody like a stuffy person they don't and you have no style or sense of fashion. Mm. Look at yourself. Are you a stuffy person? Mm. Okay. Leave that at the door, right? Let's walk on in. Let's change that. And let's get some energy. Okay? So, <laughs> energy vibes, when I tell you all, I feel like this is a great pick for a Jimson. For notes, we have bergamot mint. Mmm. Don't you like a good mint? Okay. Sometimes. Sometimes mint can be so good, and this one is, is right. Okay, moving on. We have jasmine, lavender, musk, cedar, and myrrh. Honey, I don't care what really is up in these notes because this does the thing. It does what it needs to do, and it doing, and it doing, and it does. Do. Mm, 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 mm. Ooh, baby. So my gym, babe. And you know what? I might even dab over to my brothers, right? But I feel like if you're wearing this, somebody's definitely going to compliment you because they're going to be like, wow, like what, what is that? Like that's like a, like a fresh, but citrus, but sweet. You know, I think that's what like, if a man was wearing this, that would like, hmm, yeah, yeah. you know, it'd be one of those. But I feel like, brothers, you can get away with this. My sis, this is so good. So if you in the gym, you trying to get that body body back, oh God, you know, because for me, honey, because because a sis, she trying to get her Beyonce body back. Oh, well, I don't have a Beyonce body. I'm I'm just trying to. I'm back in the gym. Getting prepared for Beyonce's concert. And I want to be skin tan so I can look good for the Beyonce concert. Okay. I ain't got the Beyonce body, but I'm trying to, I, I'm trying to do some things. So, going to the gym, hook yourself up. Okay, look, look. <laughs> she hurting. Uh, hook yourself up with energy vibes. This will get you, okay, through them lifts, through them dips, through them runs. Mm, hook yourself up, okay? Moving on. Next up. Another Miss Joe fragrance I have, okay, in my top 
Captivatingly Paris, okay? I feel like this fragrance right here is just, if you like a rose fragrance, okay? And I know you're looking at me sideways like, I don't. I'm sorry, okay? If you don't mind a sweet rose fragrance that, honestly, for me on my body, this projects, right? This fits so good. Like, there's also Fashionably London that also fits well with Delina, but I feel like this one does what it needs to do and to do and to do. Like, this also. Ooh, if you pair this with Delina, if you pair this with Delina exclusive, you hurt in the room, okay? You coming in, you know what you're doing. The room is looking at you. And you know what you're doing. You meant to do that. Clearly. <laughs> but this is so pretty. I highly recommend it. If you see this, get this. This is such a pretty pretty fragrance and it does remind you of like Paris and you know just the essence of what that would be because I've never been to Paris but what that would be in my mind this is that fragrance love it okay let's go into the notes so we have pear rose and musk now you all know and I'm not being biased on this because I do like pear I'm not but when I tell you this is such a pretty fragrance and pear doesn't come out like here I am. Move. Get out the way. This is pear, okay? Like to me, the rose speaks louder, right? The musk in this speaks louder. The pear to me gives it that sweetness. When I'm telling you, like that sweet rose, that's where that pear comes in. Like, right? It's not like you're biting a juicy pear and you're like, wah, wah. okay. That's not what I'm getting. I'm getting more of the rose, more of the musk, but because that pear is in there, it gives this the sweet balance. You cannot get enough of this. I cannot get enough of this. This is so good, okay? This will probably be on my top every time. It's, it, it's that deep. <laughs> when we never gonna get that deep on this channel. I know, I, I know. <laughs> no, but this is honestly so good. Highly recommend, if you can get this in your collection, get it, sis, all right? Moving on. Next up, sticking with the pear, okay? You all know what this is. It is new on the market, okay? Let's talk about her. So this is Sultry Pear, okay? Just got this not too long ago. And this is a juicy pear. Don't get me wrong. Juicy pear. Got it, okay? Now, what I would have loved more would this be to stay on my body. Like, I get the pear and I get the vanilla in this. And I kind of get the kind of creaminess of the praline in this. But I would have loved this to last a little bit longer, okay? If I were to say I was disappointed about something, it would just be the longevity of it. It is semi-weak on my body, right? However, but there is a but, okay? But, 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 but. She is so good, so small, compact, that I will carry this in my purse and I will re-up on the re-up on the re-re-re-up, okay? And if that's re-ing up on every two hours, then that's what I would re-up on the two hours. Because no matter the longevity of this, this is still a great fragrance. So it just had to be a part of my list for the summer. Okay, it just did. Because sometimes I don't want it to last six hours. Like sometimes I don't want fragrances to do that, right? I want you all to smell me. I'm in here. I'm moving around. I'm cool. I still want to smell good, right? But I don't need it to carry with me. It could be close to skin. It doesn't have to carry with me and project, you know, for the for the masses and the people to be a part of. I, I, so what? I like sometimes fine, but this <laughs> is so good. And again, the bottle of it, I would, I would pack this up, sis. I will 
gonna put this in my purse. Uh-huh. That's exactly what I would do. Not kick it. Ooh, baby. So let's get into the notes. So we have pear jasmine, almond vanilla, and praline. This is what you want. If you are a pear lover, okay? If you are a sweet pear lover, you need this. If you do not like pear and you're like, I can't stand pear smell, don't look at this. Like it says sultry pear. I don't know what other cute context clues to give you, right? I, I, don't, I don't know, but <clears throat> pear is in the name. So if you don't like pear, you're not going to like this. You're not going to like this, fam, like, okay? But if you are a lover of pear, like myself, hook yourself up, okay? Moving on. Next up, you all probably knew this was going to be on a list. I've talked about her a time or two, a 20, a several thousands. Um, carry the one, add the five times. Yeah, all of that. Uh, marshmallow addiction. You all knew this was about to be on here. If you did not get this, this is the old packaging. There is a new packaging that's like, I think it's like a red, purple that is similar to this, right? But I wasn't about to buy it because of the new packaging. That's not my world. But <laughs> marshmallow addiction is so good. I love this. I have raved about this fragrance. A time or two, a 20, a dozen. Um, it's just so good. Like I've talked about the sunflower, the fruitiness of this. So it gives you this creamy gourmand type of feel, but with the, like a marshmallow thought of that, like this is not like Killian's love don't be shy type of marshmallow. But when I'm telling you the creaminess of it, the gourmandness of it, the sunflower, the fruit, like all of those kind of gives you the mindset. Like, oh, this would be like a marshmallow. Like it just gives you the thought that that creaminess might be a marshmallow, right? But it's so much more than that. Like the sunflower, and don't let that turn you off if you don't like sunflower. Like it, it is such a unique but so good fragrance. Like, honey, if you don't like this, please let me know in the comments why. Like, talk to me. Let me know like your thoughts. I would love to know. Not to like say, you're crazy. Like we all have different noses. So I love you all. I love when we have differences because I get to hear your thoughts. So I love when you all do love fragrances that I love, such as this, because we get the same vibe, right? We have the same feeling. We can share those thoughts as well, but this is good. Highly recommend, definitely had to be a part of this top 10 for the summer, okay? Moving on. Next up, we have what I would recommend if you were wanting something, you just took a nice shower, right? Oh, you're glistening and looking just clean, sparkly clean, <laughs> like my sparkly dress. <laughs> if you are looking for something right out the shower to be fresh and to just put you in such a great mood, I would highly recommend Clear Honey Suckle. When I tell you this, was such a surprise. Like, I didn't think I would actually like this, but I actually love her. I love her, I love her, I really love her. I love this fragrance. This is such a great one. Like, and especially if you were like, again, out of the shower, but if you were just having a chill day or you know, you had a lot of cleaning to do, right? You were like, okay, summer, here we go. Let's do some summer cleaning. Let's let, let's change out the sheets, the bedding, and this, and pictures, and decor, and all of that. If you were looking for something that would just 
give you the, the, the energy, the beauty. If you were looking for something that you didn't have to put your expensive fragrance just to vacuum the floor, like this is what you want. Clear Honeysuckle is so good. My clean girl aesthetics, my girls that love that vibe, this is what you want, right? And the the packaging too gives me clean girl aesthetic, like gives me very much simplistic, like this is so good, okay? Highly recommend if you can get your hands on this, if this is on the Zara site, if it's not on the Zara site, maybe it's on Macari, I would highly recommend you get this. So good. Definitely had to be in my top 10 for the summer. Amazing, okay? Moving on. Next on my top 10 Zara fragrance, I have Luminous Nectar. O-M-G. When I say <laughs> everything on my list that I love, okay? You know this by now. And I don't think this would be a fan favorite for everyone. And I say that because they have galbanum and hyacinth. And I think, and they have violet too. And sometimes with a lot of different florals, in my opinion, right? Sometimes people get like off put by like maybe one of the flowers or both of them, or it's just too, it's just team too much, right? And I think that because of all the different florals that are in here, it might be team too much for some people. But I also feel if you do like floral and you like like a white pear or fruity notes with this, I think you would like it, but it is unique. And it does not give you like this cross the board, just fruity, sweet perfume. It, it doesn't give you that. It, it definitely gives you more to it with that with those floral notes. And sometimes violet can cause people to be like not only turned off, but sometimes sick, you know? Sometimes you can get like sick with the violet. And this is something that I would recommend in caution. Okay. It is on my top 10. But I would definitely recommend this as a caution because again, this is not gonna be for everyone. This is not gonna be everyone's jam. It's on my top 10. This is definitely might not be on your top 10, but I do love this and I love this for the summer. I even love this for the spring. I think this is a pretty, like a picnic scent. If I wanted to go on a picnic, if I was on a date, if I was just in a park on a picnic rug, reading a book, okay, and the breeze, you know, flowing through my hair or something. Like I would literally like, this would be one of those, you know, out in the weather, there's a breeze, you know, maybe it's not a breeze, maybe it's just a hot, hot sun, but I would still recommend this. But if you can try before you buy, I would recommend you do this with this one, but it's on my top 10, okay? Moving on. Next up, we have my Tropical Boo, okay, from Zara. <laughs> Not a Tropical Boo. Yes, yeah, she is. And this is Tropical Boost. Honey, I, eh, 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 eh. I love this fragrance. If I'm wanting something tropical, if I'm wanting something with like pineapple and just ooey gooey for roots, I would pick up and grab this. I Love sweet things. I love sometimes ooey gooey when I'm in the mood for it. I love this fragrance. But again, this might not be for everyone. This is definitely a sickly sweet fragrance. So if you do not like sweet, 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 sweet fragrances that are tropical, you're not going to jam with this. But I love that. Okay, your sister like a cookie cutter cut cake, bagels. What did he just say? Check the prompter. Why I say bagels? Cause bagels is not sweet. But pies, ice cream, <laughs> bagels. Anyway, let's go to the notes. So top notes, we have pineapple, pink grapefruit, mandarin orange. Middle notes, we have jasmine, rose, almond milk, 
brown sugar woodsy note, okay? The almond milk in this, you will get the milky or latonicness of this with the tropical scent, okay? So that's what I'm saying is like, to me, sickly, sweet, ooey gooey, like, but I do love this. And those who have it, let me know your thoughts. Those that have tried it and don't like it, let me know your thoughts. But definitely, she had to be on my top 10, okay? Moving on. And last, but certainly not least, I had to throw another rose in there. I know, I know. But, honey, for the summer, that's, what, that's what's going to be on my top, okay? All right. So we have Wonder Rose, okay? I was choosing, trying to choose between Go Fruity or Hibiscus and all that. And I was like, you know what? What do I really reach for in the summer? And it is Wonder Rose. And this is the Obsession one. I don't know if there's a real main difference, but... um. I love this. This is to me like a candy rose. Uh, she is so good. And this, oh, it's like a candied rose. Like to me, it's like Starburst Rose. <laughs> like the pink Starburst, the, the strawberry Starburst. Like this is so good. I would highly recommend. Oh, I love this. Okay. I love this with everything. If I'm just wanting to do a little more candy rose, okay, this, this gives it to me on any fragrance. I can do a must scent and pair it with this. I can do a gourmand scent and pair it with it. Like she can pair it with the best of them, okay? Love, 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 love her, okay? Let's go to the notes. So we have top notes. We have lychee, cassis, Blackberry, middle notes, rose, and two bros, base notes, vanilla, vetiver, and amber. And I know none of that says candy, 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 but I don't know what it is, but I get a candied rose, okay? If you don't get a candy rose, sorry, okay? Make sure you got the Wonder Rose Obsession because there's quite a few of them, quite a few different Wonder Roses, but this one, I love, okay? And I would highly recommend, she definitely had to be on my top, 10 Zara fragrances for the summer, okay? Moving on. That's all, that is all for this top 10 Zara fragrances for the summer. Hey, what are your favorite fragrances from Zara for the summer? I would love to know. Please comment down below. Make sure you subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. I would love to know your scent of the day. I would love to know your favorite summer fragrances from Zara. Hey. Make sure that you are good to yourself. Give yourself some grace. And if no one has told you that you are more than enough to, <coughs> huh, what? Yo, sis just did. Bye, family. I love you. Bye.